This is Jonathan from Grid Connect, and I'm going to be showing you an example of a temperature controlled relay. The parts you need is a sensor probe 2, an AC relay, a temperature sensor, and we'll be using a regular fan. For this hardware setup, first we'll go with the sensor probe 2. You want to connect an Ethernet connection to your network and the power supply. When you're done, you should see a link in activity light. Next, we will hook up the AC relay. You want to hook up the power supply to the input line voltage. We will hook up a regular Cat5 cable for the sensor input. and I will hook up a output cable. Next we will connect the temperature sensor. The temperature sensor will go into sensor port 2. And the AC relay into sensor port 1. And lastly, we will hook up the fan. When you're done, it should look like this. Next will be the software setup. This is the temperature sensor screen. It shows the different limits with critical high, warning high, um, and all the different bubbles. Next is the AC relay. You want to allow sensor to control. And last is the trigger settings under the advanced AC relay settings. This shows that temperature sensor 1 is controlling it for high warning or high critical. Last I will show you the final test. Um, to simulate it I will heat up the temperature sensor and it should turn on the fan.